I feel so much better already today, and I'm really excited. I have the whole day off until 9 o'clock when I have to go to work. So I'm thinking today I should get a whole bunch of chores done, and then I'm going to finalize my stand-up set. So I just have it down, and I can just practice it because um, I don't have that many days left before my show. I just am gonna try to get myself in as good a position so that I can kind of just chill this weekend. It's a really difficult weekend for me historically and in the past I've let that ruin my whole week, my whole month. Uh, and if I can get it down to just a couple really difficult days, then that's definitely an improvement, you know? So, that's what I'm aiming for. <sighs> you make me feel so decided to sign with the commercial agent at my theatrical agency so I think that means I don't have to self-submit at least for a little bit I just want to see how it goes um, ugh, which is gonna save me some time let me tell you I get those emails all damn day what a relief how do you get the most out of your day without any structure. I've got all day, wide open, until nine o'clock. Plenty of things that I could do, should do, even want to do. And I don't know where to start. I woke up like two hours ago and I'm just fucking around. I ate some pizza, made some tea. Now what? Anyone? Anyone? I don't have any friends I can call. I don't have family to call. All those are just distractions anyways, right? What I really need to do is my taxes. But also, a lot. So just start with one fucking thing and go. Like right now, I have absolutely no groceries in my fridge. And I want to have a good healthy week. So... I'm still getting over a cold. So I'm going to the grocery store, okay? We're gonna start there. I personally do best when I get out of the house earlier on, just cause it really gets me going. Makes me feel like a real human that exists in this world. Uh, so that's why I'm gonna do that first. And then I'm just gonna not let myself stop. Okay? You can be my witness. I sometimes have a tendency to use legitimate activities as distractions so like instead of getting real work done I'm like oh I'll just go to the grocery store I'll just go shop around at this fucking place and I'm really trying not to do that anymore but today I am at the bottom of my food barrel so it's real but you know opening up the gate to that I still have to be very cognizant on my time make sure that I'm not looking for a way to just not get my other shit done. Guys, I'm performing stand-up in four days and I don't even have my set locked down. Like, I really can't fuck around. But I gotta keep having fun too, you know? Can't take the fun out of it or else what the hell are you doing? If you're not having fun, what the fuck are you doing? Really hope they have my coffee. They didn't have it last week, and <laughs> I really like it because it's low acid, which means I can have a lot more of it without feeling just like totally weird. Since I don't take Adderall or any stimulants for ADD anymore, coffee just helps me so much. And that's still a crutch, but you know what? I'm really happy with the progress I made, and maybe one day I'll eliminate caffeine from my diet. But until then, I want my damn low acid coffee, motherfuckers. It's so good here. But they just, uh, they gotta have it. They got to. They must. Who do you think you are? Mr. Big Stuff. Just 
fucking crossing the road when you want. Fucking people. People in this town, man. Who the fuck do you all think you are? Everybody thinks there's somebody so much more than they are. When really, just being yourself is enough, man. You don't need to be some big hat shot, some weekend millionaire who pays for ladies' drinks. I mean, pay for your ladies' drinks. Makes us happy. But, just saying, stop fronting. Don't stunt. Don't be stunting. Why can't people be real? That's the real gold, man. We're all just trying to feel more human, and being around humans can be very alienating when people are pretending that they're something they're not. I get it, it's easier to pretend you're cool than admit that you're maybe not as cool as you wanna be, but I find people being able to be real with themselves extremely attractive. I don't know about you. I hope you do, because then you'll find me attractive. No. Um, I don't care if anyone finds me attractive. I think that's because I have a sense of security that enough people do that I'm not, I don't feel like I'm risking anything. But honestly, I only want people who are attracted to me for who I actually am. Because otherwise I'm gonna have to play into some dream version of myself that you think I am and that's uncomfortable to say the least. My grocery store game is all over the place. I don't even know what to buy. When I first started living on my own, I was really inspired and I was like, oh, I can't wait to cook. And well, it's been like a year and a half and now I'm like, I don't even know what to make anymore. Uh, so I'm going to a second store because I didn't like the potatoes they had at that place, but I bought corned beef for St. Patty's. We can't have that without potatoes. Whatever. I met some cool chicks in the store and I probably should have given them my number so I could have been like, hey, let's be friends. Uh, but I pussed out. I wimped up. <laughs> I didn't do a damn thing about it. Whatever. They probably have enough friends anyways. Most people do. How do you ask a new friend for their phone number? I just met all these cool chicks in the grocery store and I wanted to be like, yo, let me get your number, let's be friends. But it just felt really creepy. <laughs> right? <laughs> I should have done it. Time is just flying by. I've been working on my stand up all day and um, I was getting ready for work and my new commercial agent just hit me up and asked for all these pictures, but my hard drive is at Dylan's house. Anyway, we have to go to work. We gotta go. It's time to go. So, uh, yeah. We have to go, kids. <laughs> uh. Lurking through the trees. Yeah, of course. With, uh, with the red bush in the background. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Is this for the birthday boy? No, not for me. Really? <laughs> oh, man. Everyone's getting those fire bowls. They look really good. Make me feel so good. 